My son also has Down syndrome. Mm. So he's born with disability. And I've always thought, I'm like, why him? I, I beat myself up a lot. I'm more I'm like, why him? Why, why my son got get Down syndrome, cancer? But I, I already, uh, it's okay to question God. Yeah. I can ask him why. Uh, but my son made, that also made me stronger because his smile, the Down syndrome. I don't know what it is about kids with Down syndrome. They're beautiful people. They are. They're, They're strong there. individuals. My son is stronger Very than loving. I've ever been in my life. Very he takes loving. every downfall with a smile. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Um, okay, so I want to go back to your son a bit. So Because I know there's so many people out here who are dealing with their children going through uh, you know, chemo, cancer, and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, man, that's him. And I wanted to know, um, how, long did, how long was he going through that before he went into remission? Um, I say about three years, three years, four years, four years. During that time, what was your most detrimental time or hardening time that you had to deal with, and how did you overcome that? Probably the first year, because my son also has Down syndrome, mm. so he's born with disability, and I've always thought, I'm like, why him? I, I beat myself up a lot. I'm more than I'm like, why him? Why, why my son got get Down syndrome, cancer? But I, I already, uh, it's okay to question God. Yeah. I can ask him why. Uh, but my son made, that also made me stronger because his smile, the Down syndrome. I don't know what it is about kids with Down syndrome. They're beautiful people. They are. They're, They're strong there. individuals. My son is stronger Very than loving. I've ever been in my life. Very he takes loving. every downfall with a smile, always smiling. So if he's smiling, I got to smile. I can't show him. I know no punk. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, but that was a very tough time for me. Anything that happens to him, I get upset. Like, why? 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 <sighs> it's tough. Man. So when you heard of him getting cancer, that made it even worse. Yeah, it made it worse. So I'm, I'm sitting there like, mm, I got to hustle. But for that first year, you had to take your mind off of the situation mm -hmm. to be able to overcome it? Yeah. Or how did you? It's, it just felt like the first time they told me that my son got Down syndrome. It hurt. When did you know it was when he was born? You know, when you're pregnant, they do a test. Right. They pre-test you. They told us that he didn't have it. Wow. The day after he was born, the doctor comes in and takes him. And they like, oh, he has Down syndrome. Oh. oh. You know, being your first child, young, right. your first boy. You know, I got big plans for my son. He's going to be an NBA player. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's going to be the next Kobe Bryant. You know, and then yeah, Down syndrome. Now wow. you got to study it and figure out what this is and how, how you deal with it and how you make his it. life better. Because people don't never know anything about it until it affects you directly. Then the first thing they do is bring you a paper for for disability check. Oh, I don't care about no money. <laughs> you know, my son, he's got told about my son got Down syndrome. We might need, we get some money now every, that's not no plus for my son. Again. Money is not a plus. They shouldn't uh, be saying that. For getting, right. Well, you, not a plus for my son getting Down syndrome. But Jordan's the biggest thing that ever happened in my life. I love my son, Jordan. I got him his own TV Jordan. show. Shout out to well, Jordan. What's the TV man. show called? Best Buddies. It airs September 21st. Awesome. I got 12% of a TV network now. It's called SM1 TV. Is every, that where it's coming out? Yeah, every TV, it's on Roku. Every 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 TV producer told me no because I didn't have enough drama in my TV show. I said, you know what? You're going to regret that. And now I own 12% of a TV network called SM1 TV that's going to be on Roku. And my son's TV show is going to air awesome. September 21st. He's going to get four checks a year because of his that's daddy dope. putting that work in. I grinded for him. And you opening doors for other kids. Yes. Because kids with disabilities are beautiful. I just, I just spent the last two weeks with my manager's son. Shout out Corday. He has... Autism, and he's a beautiful kid. Yeah, I I have a big heart for kids. Period. Mm -hmm. That's why I do a lot of give backs to kids. I get five hundred shoes here. I do uh, feed the community, big barbecues. That's why the city of Topeka gave me my own day, my own mm -hmm. proclamation. That's dope. That is so you, you, awesome. you know what, what I'm saying? What day is that? May twenty second. It's T Rail Day in Topeka, Kansas. May twenty second. Remember that. This so we gotta come down there. Come on, come pull up. Yeah, come on, we pull, we gonna pull up. So they do a big festival every year. The this year, this year I gave away five hundred shoes. I fit. Uh, I fed 3,000 people. 
out of my own pocket. I don't ask for no sponsorships. I don't ask for nobody to help me. You don't have people that's automatically trying to reach out to say, how can they help? Yeah. Some people ask, but they don't know. They just want to act volunteer. But this is out of my own pocket. I do it. Man, I want the kids to be, and it's the best experience I've ever had. Because when I first wow. found out about Down syndrome, I, I started looking into it and I'm like, there are a lot of talented kids with Down syndrome, yes, piano definitely. players. I mean, it's just that they had to figure out how to focus on that certain thing. It's usually certain things that they can do, but they can excel. They're way better at it than anybody else because mm -hmm. of how they Focusing process it. Focusing on it, yeah. Process. Process. You ever looked at a child, a just regular child, mm -hmm. and they're like living carefree? Mm -hmm. Picture living carefree for your whole life. Picture yeah. living carefree. My son is about to be 13 and he don't have a care, care in, in the, the world. world. And it's gonna be that way when he's 30. Yeah, yeah. Because that mindset you have is so youthful. Yeah, yeah, you're definitely youthful. It's Man. so youthful. I love it. Love it. But no. one Go more ahead. thing I was gonna say, but I realized, you know, when you, when you say you question God and stuff like that, and this is something I learned as I got older, because I learned so much as you get older, is that everything, no matter what it is, happens for a reason. And mm -hmm. it's not always for the person that is going, that is, that is going through it, it's for the people around them. Yeah. So just like how you said, it's because of him why you're stronger. It's because of him why you are the way how you are. Yeah. So a lot, if that didn't happen, you probably wouldn't be the person that you are today. Yeah, maybe, I would need, maybe I needed those battles. You see Man. what I mean? So when people go through things, it's always for somebody around. You might not know who it is for. And just like a TV show that you said you now created where now the world can see him. Too, mm -hmm. He'll help so it. many more That's other right. people. Yeah. people That's hearing right. your story. about a, a, a father raising a child with disabilities. Yeah. Showing the ups and downs. Exactly. It's going to help somebody. And a lot of parents are into that show. I told him a lot of parents would be into this show. People are going to see that. And you're going to help. You're going to have so many people reaching out to you and saying, telling you thank you. Yeah, you know, sometimes, I ain't going to lie to y'all, sometimes I feel people feel t rail more than they feel my music. No, no, real. That's real. I'm I more, just told you that when we started. I'm more of a personality than an artist sometimes. No, that's But that's real. why you got to do this because it's everybody... Because of the joy. The joy that you show and display yeah. on your, your character, on your on your... Your artistry is there and it's dope. Don't get me twisted, but you're a good dude. I knew that. That was made. That's what made, drew me to T. Rail. People yeah. got to fall in love with you before they fall in love with your work. Yeah, that's really people love my music. I'm saying people love my music. You just go hard. I just feel man. there's people that I see. I read comments. They're like, bro, I didn't even know one of your songs. That's right. But I love you. Yeah. I'm like, oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank Do you. you respond to all of your. I try to. It it's easy. hard because. I got a lot of followers. Damn right. <laughs> uh, but if I try. That's good. You can ask my bus driver. He tell you I take pictures with everybody. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.